Uh, they need to stop this because that, folks, was not a catch, and they did not get it stopped in time. That is a huge break. It's a 32-yard play. You only need one foot down in the XFL, but we'll take a look at that again. But remember, it's got to be post control. Okay, so you got to establish control first. Now control is there. He's clearly out of bounds. So a big miss here from this replay booth, and. Right now they're stopping, but it's a flag out in the defensive backfield. And they've run another play since then, so they can't go back That's to right. review that. Who we got, ref? Are we good or we have 11 or 12? Prior to the snap, defense had too many men on the field. Five-yard penalty. First down. So back to back bad breaks for Kevin Gilbride's team. Yeah, and, and again, when you get a break like that, that that's an incomplete ball. And, right. But for Dallas, from their point of view, they did the right thing. They got up to the line of scrimmage. They snapped it quickly in order to avoid that replay. And then now you've got to pay it off and capitalize on that fortunate break. And we'll see if they can do that here. The ball in the red zone here on their first possession. Yeah, from the 14 yard line now. Working from the shotgun, Nelson. Trying to stretch this one out, being chased from behind. Good job of pursuit by Ben Heaney. Yeah, Heaney did a great job in there. He's a linebacker for them, and he gets the pressure and forces Nelson out of the pocket to his right. But here you see a big change for Bob Stoops, which is without Landry Jones at quarterback, they've got a little more athleticism with Philip Nelson, who was able to create a little bit and make a positive play. That is something that was not going right for them after Heaney's pressure in the backfield. All right, they spread their tight end Parham out to, to, to the top of the screen, out wide. He may be the best tight end in this league. Probably no maybe about it. They go to him and overthrows him. That's the right idea when you got a guy out there. He's 6'8", folks, 255, 260 pounds. Definitely has filled out a little bit since his time at Stetson where he played his college football. But he is a breakout star right now in this XFL. And he's a guy that they've got to target early in this game and often. And they're going for it on fourth and six early. Actually, it's third down. Third and six. Here's Nelson. <laughs> Stepping up. Flynn Nagel, and he's hit right away. Demetrius Cox laying him out. And that will bring up a fourth down. But he got in there in that short yardage situation. That was third down, and now you're going to have to go for it, I believe, if you're Dallas. I know you'd love to come away with points, but it's even better to come away with a touchdown early. Keep in mind, huge defensive tackles for New York. These guys in the middle, they run 300 pounds each. Here we go. Cameron Artis Payne falling forward, gets the first. It'll be first and goal. 